and I'm a primate. I'm here at Auckland Zoo with primate keeper Vanessa. Hi everyone. And we're going to meet some more primates. Come on out. So Paige, this is where our cotton top tamarind monkeys and our Gooty live. We're going to give them an insect feed okay. and also some banana smears. Mm -hmm. This is a locust. Okay. So you just kind of hold it at the back there and then she will take it from you and demolish it. So insects are a, a large part of their diet in the wild along with, whoop, that's the wing getting stuck. How many cotton tops are in here? We've got four cotton top tamarins in this enclosure. The male and the female, the parents of our two new babies, which are twins. And they're two months old. Aww. These are called mealworms. Mm -hmm. Let's hold them out there and she'll take them out of your hand. Can you guess how they get their name? Their little hair looks like a cotton ball. That's right, that's exactly right. <laughs> and here comes Mr. Nuri with our new babies. What do you think of them, Paige? They're so adorable. And think this is the first yeah. time we've had cotton top babies in 16 years oh here at Auckland Zoo. Wow. Here we go. Well done. Can you see the baby eating? Yeah. Do you know where they come from? No. They come from Colombia in uh, South America. Are there many cotton tops in the wild? Their numbers are quite critical. They're in fact critically endangered. And a lot of that is due to deforestation. When their habitat and the forest is being chopped down? That's correct. What we ask people to do is when they're buying any wood or paper products, like outdoor furniture or toilet paper, is to check on the packaging for a symbol that is a tree with a big tick. That means that they're not destroying cotton top habitat in the wild. I'll make sure I check for that next time we go shopping. Brilliant. Well Paige, it looks like we're out of food, so we better go and feed some other monkeys. Yep, well, cool. Let's go. With the squirrel monkeys, that's a lovely little treat for them, the peas and corn. It's a bit like lollies to them. And just be prepared, they might jump all over you. you just come stand over here next to me. Okay, one second, wait, wait, wait. Now you can open the lid. Whoa, oh. <laughs> hold tight, because they're going to be. Oh. oh my gosh, I'm loving it. They're really curious. Are they clever? Yes, they have the largest brain to body size ratio of all primates. Wow. Hello. Oh, don't fall off. Oh, you look quite comfortable there, covered in monkeys, <laughs> Paige. I want to be a primate keeper when I'm older. Oh, hello. We've also got some other visitors. So the squirrel monkeys also share this enclosure with our capybara. They're the world's largest rodent. Wow. <laughs> oh, oh, my gosh. Um, I think there's a squirrel monkey on my head. I've had such a cool day today seeing all these amazing primates. The baby cotton tops were just so cute riding on their dad's back. And it's been incredible having all these squirrel monkeys jumping all over me. The capybaras are just so cute eating their grass. I've had an awesome day today. See ya. <laughs>